going on now. Welcome back. We're so excited. Oklahoma City's first ever professional fast pitch softball team will be representing our state all the way across the pond in Great Britain. The Oklahoma City Spark will be playing uh, in the national. If you could fast both, pitch both softball both team. The, can you Royal reverse Spark the prompter challenge. so I can get this right? Here we go. They will be playing in the. I'm so sorry. It's the national fast pitch softball team uh, in the Royal Spark Challenge this summer. And uh, we have some special guests <laughs> to talk about it. <laughs> Teleprompter issues. So sorry. Tina Floyd, the owner Yay. and OSU standout, Chelsea Alexander. Thanks for joining us live in studio. We yes. appreciate it. Thank you for yeah. having us. Oh my gosh, Tina. She gave me a little heads up. She's like, some big news is coming. <laughs> this is so huge for, it's like a uh, spark across the pond, it right? Is. I mean, it's a huge <laughs> challenge. How did all this come to be? I, I struck a friendship with T uh, Tara Henry. She runs a D1 podcast and, and she kind of follows D1 sports. And she's she was named their head coach for Great Britain. Oh my god! And gosh. so we started talking early on. She's like, "Would this be an option? What do you think? You you have a great lineup, and mm -hmm. we need some stiff competition." And I took that as a compliment. So mm -hmm. here we are. We worked it out, and uh, we're the first professional softball team to ever go play over there. I love that. Is softball big in England? I don't think it's as big as it is okay. in Oklahoma. <laughs> yeah, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Hard to compete with. Yeah. yeah. There you go. We'll talk about big names. You know, Jossie Hallow's on your team. Chelsea is on your yes. team. Chelsea, you were playing for OSU a year ago at this time. Yes, I am. Yes. Uh, and to continue into a professional league. I mean, what does this mean for you? How excited are you? Oh, I'm pumped. It took me a while to warm up. We joke. Um, I wasn't really sure that I was going to go play professional. It wasn't on my radar. And I, I had no intentions because college softball was kind of it. It was my, my end goal. And when they came and talked to me, I just couldn't give up the opportunity to represent my state, continue doing what I love, and really build a sport for the, the girls below me. Uh -huh. How is this going to work with the uh, Great Britain Women's Senior National Fast Pitch Softball Team? Goodness, that's a lot. <laughs> okay. We got it, we got it. The prompter didn't work for me earlier, but here we go. How is it going to work, though? Is it a couple of exhibition games? Yes. Is it like a tournament? What? It's a tournament, or an exhibition, I'm sorry, because the next week, all national teams report to Italy mm -hmm. to play for the World Cup. Oh, wow. wow. So we're a, a warm-up for them, uh -huh. uh, but... Well, watch out. Yeah. <laughs> they might not be too up. happy yeah. about the warm-up with the girls you're bringing over there, well, right? I'm ready. <laughs> when, when are you going? What's the timeline? We leave July 4th. Okay. We have a break in our season for yeah. about a week, so we leave July 4th, and we'll be back July 9th. I love it. So the, the ladies get a day off, too. There to you kind go. Of Your season's right yeah, around starting. the corner. Yes. Tell me about it. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Chelsea, how, how are you feeling going into this? Oh, I'm excited. I, I was a little nervous because I hadn't been working out, but I got back in shape and started <laughs> practicing more, and now I'm really ready. It's coming up quick, and it's exciting. Awesome. Tina, this has been a crazy year for you. You're an educator by uh, your heart. You guys had a big RV business. I mean, now you're the owner of a professional I softball know. team. A this good is crazy. One too. <laughs> <laughs> and a doctor. I yes, know, you I just got your weekend. doctorate. Yes, yes congratulations. congratulations. Um, it's been a very crazy year, but I feel like I'm doing exactly what I need to be doing and helping the sport and helping these females do what they need to do to move forward. So you're empowering. I feel like I'm in the right spot. Yeah, you're empowering so many young women. How I does hope that so. feel? Thank you. Uh, it feels overwhelming, but it's, <laughs> uh, I'll tear up if I think about it. But I feel like I'm in the right spot and doing what I need to be doing. Chelsea, right. how exciting is this um, that you are able to kind of live out more of your dream? You know, for a long time, it kind of stopped after college for a lot of athletes. How does it feel that you get to keep going? Yeah, absolutely. For me, it wasn't. I'll be honest, it wasn't like a big dream to go be a professional athlete because we didn't see that. We didn't have mm -hmm. that that in our minds growing up. Like you have MLB players and NFL NBA, and NBA. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. exactly. So for me, it's a bigger deal to be that for the little girls now mm -hmm. and that. let them see that and see what they can do. And that can be their goal. And that's something I, you know, I really cherish. I want to ask you, what's it like playing with some former Sooners? Jocelyn, I mean, let's hey, just, we, we just we got the regional orange. starting. Yeah. yeah so uh, tell us about that. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's exciting. It's something like we play with the best of the best. And that's what Tina and Amber have done a really good job is getting the best athletes. And a lot of them are at OU and OSU. And so to have those ties to Oklahoma, I think it's a win-win for the players as well as the team and our fan base here. So it's exciting. I'm excited to compete and represent the whole state yes. alongside some really great players. That's so great. How can we watch what's going on when you guys go to Great Britain? We're working that out through okay. Great Britain. Um, London, I, I just call them Great Britain. Yeah, so we're, <laughs> we're working that out. So as soon as we have that, we'll make sure all 
all of our fans here locally know and around the country. It's weird. I've seen shirts in Hawaii now. Um, oh, imagine that. Yes. Yes. Wow. Yeah. When we have that, I'll make sure I get it to you, ladies. Okay. So you can so you can follow along. Love it. We can't wait. Thank you guys so much Thank for you. coming. Thanks. And uh, we're going to be cheering for the spark. We can't wait to, for the action to awesome. begin. Tina, Chelsea, thank, thank you. you. All right.